Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Already I have posted the Redmi Note 10 smartphone unboxing and review. Well, in this video, I am going to do its uh, fast charging and battery drain test in this video. Well, first of all, let's start with the fast charging. So, in the fast charging, I have actually uh, done the fast charging in the two different ways. One is while well, phone is, is in the switch off condition and during phone switch on condition. Like this, in these two different ways, we are going to do the fast charging test. And after that, we are going to do the battery drain test. And I have done all these things already. And during the battery drain test, I'll, I'll tell you the statistics of the total screen on time of this Redmi Note 10 smartphone from the 100% to the 0% of the battery. Well, firstly, start this video with this Redmi Note 10 smartphone fast charging test. Well guys, now the phone is in the on condition and, and now the battery level is 1%. We'll start the fast charging and the time is 2.36 pm. And as well as we also check uh, how the heat condition of the smartphone as well as. And similarly, we have uh, done some of the uh, battery drain settings also turned on like Wi-Fi connected location turned on, Bluetooth is also turned on. So at this condition, we'll check how the battery performs. Well, now the time is 2.55 p.m. So the total time taken is 19 minutes. So at this time, 23% of battery is charged. And during this time also, so the phone uh, the phone uh, heating is not that much. It has very less heat at the rear side. And at the front side, it's having slightly heat at the display panel. That is also very, very light only. Well, now the time is 3.51 p.m. So 68% of charge is so far and total time taken is 1 hour 15 minutes. As well as we check the phone heating condition. So during this time also the phone heat is not that much. So the rear panel is not having so much of heat and the camera model is also not having that much heat. So only the display panel is having the heat. Now the time is 4.31 pm, so 97% of charge is totally completed. So total time taken is 1 hour 55 minutes. So it's actually too high only and at this condition also no heat. Well, overall the during phone on condition, so full charge is completed in 2 hours. Well, now let's check the fast charging during the phone off condition. So now the phone is completely turned off and the battery percent is at the 0%. Now the fast charging is started, so around 40 seconds has been completed, so now only 2% of charge has been filled up. And now the battery percentage is at 16% has been filled up, so total time taken is 6-7 minutes. And during this condition also, so the rear panel is as well as, as like in the phone on condition, no more heat, only the display panel is having the heat. Now the phone battery is 46 percentage is completed. So total time is taken is 22 minutes and it is actually fastly charging than the during phone uh, on condition and the heat is no, also not having that much. So the heat is very very less. We'll check how the battery is fully completed and in how much hours. Now the battery is 50 percentage of battery is completed so total time taken is only 23 minutes and now 80 percentage of battery is completed so in 43 minutes 31 seconds and at this condition also no more heat and heat is also slightly reducing and during the 1 hour 2 minutes of time 95 percentage of charge is completed so far. Well, finally, 100% of batteries has been completed. So the total time taken is 1 hour 17 minutes. So that is a huge difference between the phone off and on condition. As well as the charger adapter is also not having that much heat. Well, now switch on the smartphone. Well, guys, on the fast charging test results. So as you've seen here, there is a wide variation between the during phone off and on condition during the fast charging so during the phone on condition so it actually takes around two hours to complete the full charge and during phone off condition it actually takes only one hour 17 minutes to complete the full charge so this is the differences between the during phone off condition and the on condition so there is a more variation so while in the fast charging the between the during phone off and the on condition and similarly, there is a difference in during in the phone off condition also between the first 50 percentage of charge to the next 50 percentage of charge. So it actually charges 
first 50 percentage of battery in at just 23 minutes but the next 50 percentage of charge it actually takes up to 54 minutes to complete the full charge so here during the phone off condition also there is a difference this is because of the reduction in the fast charging so during the starting time the phone is actually charges fastly but after reaching a certain level it actually literally reduces the fast charging step by step so that's why it takes uh, uh, 54 minutes to complete the second of 50% uh, of battery. Well, now let's move on to the battery drain test. So during the battery drain test, so for battery draining, so I have used the multiple factors like uh, uh, watching YouTube videos and uh, playing games and also putting the smartphone for some time with the idle also. Well, firstly, let's start the battery drain test from the 100% of a battery. So now the battery is actually at the 100 percentage and uh, now I actually played a YouTube uh, videos for uh, around 3 hours. So for playing a 3 hours of a YouTube videos, so it actually reduced uh, it actually reduced 22 percentage of battery. So now the battery level is at the 78 percentage. So during this uh, 3 hours of a YouTube uh, videos playing, it reduced 22 percentage of battery and during this time, so I'm playing for a YouTube videos for around two, three hours also. The smartphone is not goes to the that much of heat condition also. Well, now in the 78 percentage of battery, so I have started playing the game for a one hour 21 minutes. For this, for playing a one hour 21 minutes, it actually reduced 17 percentage of battery. So the now the battery is moves to the 61 percentage for the one hour 21 minutes of gameplay and during the gameplay also the smartphone is not produced that much heat and likewise uh, it is actually based on a Adreno based GPU so it is not having that much lag and the graphics is also too good well now next 45 minutes I have actually put the smartphone to the idle mode so during this 45 minutes the smartphone is actually discharges 6 percentage of battery now the smartphone actual battery percentage is at 55 percentage well now again started playing games for a more than next one hour so for playing a next one hour of gameplay it actually reduces 14 percentage of battery so during this time playing a game it actually will produce light heat but uh, but there is no lag and the graphics is also too good so now the battery level is actually reduced from 55 percentage to 41 percentage of a battery so now the battery level is at the 41 percentage and again now i am putting the smartphone to the idle for two hours so for two hours it actually takes only six percentage of reduction in the battery percentage so now the battery percentage is at 35 percentage of battery percentage level so during this 35 percentage level of battery and and again I'm playing a uh, one hour of a gameplay and uh, during this time it actually reduces only 8 percentage of battery level. So as you've seen here, so uh, before 50 percentage of battery when I'm playing a one hour of gameplay, it actually takes 14 percentage of battery. And after a 50 percentage, uh, that means uh, below 50 percentage of battery level and this time I play a game for a one hour, it actually takes only 8 percentage of battery percentage. So that is the differences between the 100 to 50 percentage of battery level and then 50 percent is the zero percentage of battery level and at the same time there is also some other differences also so depends upon the gameplay you are playing so the like that also the battery percentage reduction in, uh, will also depends upon so like in case if you are playing a higher graphics level gameplay means so for that it redu reduces a certain amount of a battery percentage and in case if you play uh, some uh, small graphics games like that means it uh, if it's time for a more hours for with the less percentage of battery reduction well overall now the battery percentage is at 27 percentage and now with the 25 percentage too it actually reduces to 16 percentage so these 11 percentage of batteries actually reduced because of i have used some of the camera shots i have taken and i uh, goes for a browsing for a 30 minutes so for this it actually reduces 11 percentage of battery now the smartphone is at 16 percentage of battery which means the smartphone is almost going to die position at this condition i am again play a game for, for one hour 20 minutes so for uh, playing a one hour 20 minutes of gameplay it actually reduces the whole 16 percentage of battery and the phone is goes to the dead condition 
the phone battery is completely zero and the phone is goes to the switch off mode so totally overall in the battery drain uh, test so these are all its overview so for from zero from 100% to zero percentage so it actually plays three hours of video playing and four hours 41 minutes of gameplay and two hours 45 minutes of idle time and one hour and one hour of a camera accessing and a browsing totally it actually gives 11 hours 30 minutes of a screen on time so that is more than enough for a user so in case if you are a user if you are going to the office and uh, so if you are going to the morning and if you are coming to the home at the evening means so the 11 hours of screen on time is uh, definitely more than enough and also i have this uh, long term idle also so during at a 50 percentage of battery and I kept the smartphone for idle. So from the 50% of battery, it actually withstand one and a half days with the idle condition. So in case if you keep the smartphone idle means, so from the 50% of battery, it gives you one and a half days of the battery consumption. Well, overall, that's all about this video. So this is the Redmi Note 10 smartphone fast charging and battery drain test from our site. So what are your guys thoughts on this video? Let me know in the comment section below. And in case if you are a user already using this Redmi Note 10 smartphone means. So what are your thoughts about this smartphone performance? Let us know in the comment section below. So that's all about this video guys. And hopefully if you guys like this video, hit the like button. And if you guys like to watch my upcoming videos, hit the subscribe button below. And thanks for watching this video guys.